guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to go over a video on how we can take multiple Excel sheets and condense them down to one. While we do this, we can also sort out fields that are important to us and the fields that aren't. Let's jump right in. The first thing we need to look at are the Excel sheets that we want to work with. Looking at our first workbook, we can see that we have four fields, the location, employees, revenue, and profit. On our second one, we can see that we have the same fields, locations, employees, revenue, and profit, but we also have some additional fields that aren't important to us and also a field that doesn't make sense. So let's close out of these and open up a new script. Hopping over to a blank terminal, the first thing we need to do is import the package that we're going to use. So import pandas as pd. Go ahead and save your file. I'm going to call my merge excel.py and hit save. Now we need to load in the Excel sheets that we want to use. So Excel1 equals workbook1.xlsx and then Excel2 is equal to workbook2.xlsx. These are just the file names of those Excel workbooks that I showed you before. Now to read these into pandas, we need to use a function called read Excel. We can do this with df1 equals pd.read Excel, and then Excel1. Let's do this for both of them. Now that we've read these in, let's go ahead and make sure it works by typing out print df1. Save your file, open up a terminal, and run your Python script. You can do this by typing Python3 and then the name of your script. Mine is mergeexcel.py. Hit return. And we get a list of everything that was in that Excel file. Drop down a few lines and now let's determine what values are important to us. So values one, and then let's call the data frame like this, two square brackets, and now we can list all the fields that we want in our data frame. So let's put locations, employees, revenue, and profit. I know that these are the only fields in this Excel sheet right now, but that could change in the future. So let's go ahead and explicitly state it right here in this line. Let's do the same thing for the second one as well. So values two equals data frame two. I just realized that we forgot to put a one right here. So data frame two, and then the same fields. So locations, employees, revenue, and profit. After this, we need to state all the data frames that we want our Python script to use. So drop down a few lines, type in data frames, square brackets, and then type values one, and then values two. The last thing we need to do is to concatenate our data frames together. We can do this by typing in a variable. So I'll call mine join and then pd.concat and then data frames, which was the variable that we just defined. Lastly, we need to write a new Excel file with these data frames on it. We do this by typing in the new data frame that we just concatenated and then the function to Excel. And then we specify the name of our file. I'm calling mine output.xlsx. Save your file, go back down to your terminal, and rerun your script. Once it's ran, we can go back to the desktop, find the new file, and see that it has all the fields that we wanted from these two workbooks. Just as we expected, we join both of them together in only the fields that we wanted. We can see that it's actually two workbooks by using these index values as well. If you don't want that, you can choose to remove it in your Python script. And that's how you join multiple spreadsheets together using Python. You can do this with as many Excel workbooks as you want. That's all for the video. So if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below and I'll try to get back to you. Thanks for watching. Until next time.